Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I am super excited for this video. It is way overdue. I was going to film this a very long time ago. Time passed. I forgot for a moment and then I was like, oh my gosh, I need to film this video. It's a little bit late, but it could be helpful even going into summer. So I have a bunch of shoes. So if you are a shoe lover, I'm really excited about the shoes I'm about to share. Also, I have not filmed in like a week and a half and I feel like off. Like I, I don't know, I feel like weird. I'm like, whoa, I'm filming a video. This is strange. Also, I have not filmed in like a week and a half. I took last week completely off. It was like Mother's Day. We had a bunch of stuff going on. I always usually film on the weekends. Then during the week, I was like, maybe I'll try to film. And that did not happen. My children like, were horrible nappers and I just I didn't have time so today I finally can sit down and it's like about to storm I don't know the lighting could get really really weird in this video and I apologize but today's video we are talking all about shoes we are going to be talking about spring but really kind of summer shoes I wear pretty much my spring shoes into summer a lot of these shoes yeah, I wear like all spring and summer. So I have new shoes, I have old shoes that are still around that are amazing and like I've had for, I've actually, some of the shoes I've had for a couple years now and they're just like, they held up so nicely. I can wear them with a lot of things. Um, so today's video, I'm not only gonna share with you the shoe, I'm actually gonna share with you guys an outfit idea with the shoe. I'm not gonna share like multiple outfits with one pair of shoe, cause that would be a really long video. And I have 10 pairs of shoes. So 10 outfits, 10 pairs of shoes, great for spring and going into summer here. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, so the first pair of shoes I'm gonna share with you guys are these sneakers right here and they've been in and out of stock. And I feel like honestly, these have been my most worn. I have worn these things to death. And I like them because they're already kind of supposed to be like destroyed, but like I have destroyed them even more but it looks okay because that's like the look you're going for and they are not the golden goose they are not the real ones they are fake <laughs> and they are pleather so you'll feel your feet will sweat in them but I love them they just go with everything I love the shape of them on my foot and I can wear them really casually they are from Shein and like I said they've been coming in and out of stock so grab them they do run I think I got yeah I got a size 41 and I'm a size US 9. So just keep that in mind. They run very small, size up, I would say a whole size. And they're so cute. I just love them. <laughs> they're not like golden goose. I, I will never buy, I don't know. I shouldn't say that. I wouldn't never buy a golden goose pair. I really like them. They're really cute, but this is a good way to try them. And I love them, so. That's shoe number one. All right, guys, so shoe number one, I'm actually just sharing what I'm wearing today, which is super comfortable, casual, and these shoes I wear with anything. So I am wearing shoe number one. Like I said, I would wear these really casually with some sweatshorts and a sweatshirt, but I'd wear them with jeans. I wear them with everything, but I thought I'd give you just a really casual outfit idea and yeah i love these shoes they're so cute and comfortable but definitely size up one all right shoe number two are one of my favorites i bought them last year i have lived in them they i literally wore them all the time last year they were always on my feet they're perfect for summer they're amazing leather they're totally worth the i guess investment they are a little more pricier but they they literally go with everything I love them and they are these right here from free people they are the best sandals ever I love them I love the color of them they make you look taller without wearing like a really high wedge or heel and they are so comfortable the leather is just like butter they come and they feel like worn in and buttery like I said they go with so much stuff and I just love them I love them they're like legit if I had to rank all of my shoes this would probably be my number one shoe I love them and you need them and especially in this color I love this color 
All right, shoe number two, I just put with a little jumpsuit. Normally, because I'm short, I would always feel like I have to wear a heel with this, but because these shoes make you kind of look longer, I can wear these with them. And I can wear these with a lot of different things, but I threw on a little jumpsuit with it. Uh, just so you guys can see the color and I think they are so cute on. By the way, these run true to size. I am a true size nine and these are a size US nine and the color of them is called, I think it's called natural, but I think on different sites they're called different things, but uh, I think they got these off of Nordstrom and they're called natural. So hopefully that helps. All right, shoe number three is a brown sandal. These have been worn, these are actually the older version. I've had these now for like four years, I think. And I love them. They are my favorite brown sandal. They are so worn. Like look at the tips there. They're like totally worn and used. And like, I think the stitching is like coming out in places because I have worn these things to death. They are my favorite shoes and they are from Sam Edelman. Um, this, I think like the newer version is slightly different, but I also found like an almost identical pair that are these right here. They are Sam Edelman's. They look exactly the same. Like, I don't really know, but these I found at DSW for like way cheaper. I bought these for like, I think like $80 almost. And these were like 30 or 40 dollars at DSW and they're real leather like they're really nice and I love a good brown sandal so I bought these because I'm like I wear these things all the time I need a new pair so I definitely think a brown sandal is essential I love these I will link the newer version of these and these down below in case you want to shop like a higher end version I don't really know the difference if you want to go cheaper, I say get these. Um, the look is a little different. This has like this little loop here and these kind of look the exact same, but it has like a little like piece right here or something. So yeah, I, I love them. They're so comfortable and they are literally my favorite sandal ever. All right, shoe number three, totally. This is an everyday outfit for me. This is what I just throw on, especially when it's really hot out. I love these sandals to just slip on. They're super comfortable. I love mixing black and brown. That's like one of my favorite things, but super, super comfortable, really easy, very basic outfit, but I love these sandals. They are so good. All right, shoe number four is a Espadrill kind of platform that I purchased recently, and I love them. They are so cute. They are by Vince Camuto. They are so comfortable, you guys. If you're looking for a good, cute little closed-toed espadrill, these are so cute and they are, like I said, so comfortable. Like, it's so squishy. And I like that it gives me a little bit of height. Um, it has a really cute ankle strap. They are a little suede. And I just love the detailing. They're really feminine, so they look cute with dresses. Um, but even like shorts and a t-shirt, they look cute with. So I thought these are a really nice purchase and I'll show you guys an outfit idea with them. And these run true to size. All right, next up are the espadrilles. Don't mind, I still have my bralette on. <laughs> I would not wear the bralette with the dress, but I am wearing it just a little baby doll dress, which you'll see in an upcoming video as well. Um, but I think the espadrilles actually look super cute with this dress. They're really feminine and I love the ankle strap, the close toe, they're so comfortable definitely suggest them. So this is definitely an outfit idea for these shoes. All right, shoe number five I found last year and I love them. They are my favorite wedges that I have in my closet. They're pretty much the only wedges I have in my closet because they are so comfortable. They're really cute and flattering on. And I think this year, like everybody made a version of these because they were so popular and they are these right here. But I have to say the leather is so so nice on it. It's so buttery and they're super comfortable to wear. I can wear these for long periods of time and they do not hurt at all. Um, I just love the ankle strap is really, really nice and cute and flattering. I love the brown because it goes with a lot of different things and these are definitely my favorite wedges. Okay, another dress you'll see in an upcoming video, but I'll still link it. Um, I love wearing my wedges with really long dresses like this that are kind of like right at the ankle and then show the shoe. I think it's so cute, especially like a really boho -y dress. You could wear wedges with so many different things, but I do especially like wedges with this kind of dress. So I thought 
thought I would share. Favorite way to wear the wedges. All right, shoe number six is my Burks. Can't go wrong with a pair of Burks. They're really comfortable. And if you're pregnant, you kind of need a pair of these because when your feet swell and you're hot and you're sweaty and you're pregnant and you feel like poo poo, like these are like so nice to just slip on and wear when you are swollen and uncomfortable. <laughs> so if you're pregnant, got a pair of Burks. But also if you're not, these are really comfortable shoes. I love wearing them. I know some people think they're so ugly. I love them and I will continue to wear them and I love my white pair. Um, I also really like the rose gold ones that are out but the white pair is just, just makes your feet look tan so I love them. Okay for my Burks, I actually feel like Burks can be tricky especially for me who is short and have a very large feet. So I'm just wearing that same t-shirt I actually wore before but this time I like wearing my Burks with boyfriend jeans so like kind of baggy kind of distressed jeans, very slouchy look. I feel like look really cute with Burks. I don't normally like to wear shorts with Burks because I feel like it makes my legs look shorter, but with like really kind of slouchy jeans, I like to wear them. Um, yeah, I, I normally like to wear them with jeans, but I think they're so comfortable, definitely worth it. I love my Burks. All right, shoe number seven is something that I think is sold out, but I'm going to link them in multiple places because there have been like random restocks, different colors, different sizes. So I'm just gonna link them. I'm really sorry if your size and this color is sold out, but I love them and I had to share them because I'll be wearing them. I've already worn them a lot this spring and I will be wearing them all summer too. And they are these mules right here. They're like a woven mule. They're so cute. And maybe I'll try to link a couple similar ones because I have seen a lot of similar shoes like this. I think even Madewell has um, a very similar shoe to this, but I love them. They're so cute and they're really, these are really nice and buttery soft. But I just think the woven little mule is so fun for spring and summer. It's very summery feeling and I wear these things with everything. I wear them with jeans, with shorts. I wear them with dresses. Like, I love them. They are so cute. All right, next outfit you might have already seen on my Instagram if you follow me on Instagram. I've already shared this entire outfit and it's one of my favorites recently. I just love it. I love this little sweater tank. Um, I just, I love it. I think it's super summery and springy and I've already gotten really good wear out of it. And also my one of my favorite pairs of jeans in my closet, I wear these a lot. Again, if you follow me on Instagram, you've seen these jeans. And then these really cute woven mules. I think it's a really cute outfit, very spring into summery outfit. And if you can find these mules, grab them, they're so good. Number eight is another mule that won't be a surprise to you because I wear them all the time. I've had them for quite a few years and they are the Madewell mule. I love these. People have asked me if I like the, which is this one, the Gemma, Gemma Mule, or the Remy, I think it's called, which the Remy is like slightly cut right here. I personally, for my huge, huge feet and my shortness, I like these. <laughs> I know that sounds weird, but I like the very pointed toe. Um, I think the Remy's have a more almondy toe. These have a more pointy toe. I just like the pointy toe because it makes me look taller with my very large skis that I have. <laughs> so I love these. Um, I did have to size up half a size in these and they're just a great shoe to have. Honestly, you can wear them all th the way through fall. They just, they carry you all the way through fall. So they're just a good shoe to have in your closet, go with a lot of things and I love them. All right, next up is these mules that I've talked about and shared a million times, but I just threw on a denim dress with it. Love this look, love this outfit. I've worn these shoes so many different ways <laughs> and so many different times they're a little bit boring but I love them and I had to share them so this is how I would style them. All right number nine are these right here I recently picked these up and I think they are so cute they were in my cart for a while and I was like should I get them should I not and then I went and I grabbed them and I totally do not regret it because they are so comfortable like this footbed like it like molds to your foot. These are like stretchy, but like not scratchy. They like wrap around your foot very comfortably. I love the platform of them. They're just really comfortable shoes. They give you like height, 
but not uncomfortable height and they're really flattering on. I got the, I can't remember what color this is. I think it's the blush beige color, blush pink color. Um, but I just, they're really flattering on. And like I said, they're super, super comfortable. I went with my true to size and they are so cute. Such a good shoe for spring and summer. All right, next up are the newest sandals that are in my closet. I actually threw them on with my linen pants. I did a whole video on these linen pants and how I styled them. So I will link those down below, that video down below as well. Um, and then I threw on just a little lace trim cami with it. So really summery, really springy and... All right, last shoe I'm gonna share and it's really, really random and silly, but you guys know, if you do know, if you've been watching my videos for a very, very long time, you might know that I really love to run. It is my favorite thing and when summer, so really spring comes around and the weather starts to change. I am outside. I'm running. I'm not inside working out. I'm always out for a run. I just, it's like my me time. It's like my, it's like mental exercise as well as physical exercise, which I love. Um, so they are these right here and these are my new running shoes. I used to run in Nike, which I know most runners are like, I don't run in Nike, but I had a pair of Nikes that I loved, but they are they bit the dust last year and I purchased these and I've been running in these since I've been able to run here and they're awesome. They are super comfortable. I love them. They are by Brooks and they are the Ghosts 11. Um, but I also like them because they're not so like running shoes get like really flashy and like very crazy looking and like very vibrant and like crazy. And you guys know me, I'm very like neutral i want neutral colors um so i got these also because they are all gray but they are really good running shoe as well they fit my foot great i haven't had any problems with like shin splints or like ankle pain or any kind of pain really and they are just great and the treading is awesome on them as well i'm like holding gross disgusting shoes I need to wash my hands after this video, but yeah, they are, the treading is really great on them and clearly I went for a run this morning, um, but they're awesome shoes. If you're looking for a really good running shoe, I highly suggest these. All right, and I'm not going to put these on because they are full of grass and it was raining while I was running. So I'm, I'm not going to put them on, but I mean, I wear them with workout clothes. <laughs> I wear them running. And sometimes I don't look even this cute when I go running. I wear mismatched things and I just go for a run. I don't care what I wear when I work out. I don't need to look cute. I'm not one of those people. I just throw on gross clothes and go run. Um, but yeah, these shorts are amazing though. I've shared them in my, I think it was my last favorites video. They're so good. They are so affordable and they're great for running. Um, and I got them off Amazon for like 25 bucks. So check these out. I'll link them. Yeah, I guess this is what I'd wear when I go running. Sometimes, like I said, I don't look so good when I go running. So yeah. All right, guys. So that is it for my spring summer shoe roundup. I hope you guys enjoyed this video along with the outfit ideas that I put with each shoe. Let me know if you liked it by giving it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you are not, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.